health earlier, 549 days. Yeah. How, how did it feel? <laughs> no, it was good. It was really good today. And, um, you know, it was, it was really just two pitches that weren't quality pitches. Uh, but as far as, you know, I think I got a swing and miss on all my off stuff, so that was good. And just to be back out there with those guys, I mean, just, uh, you know, your, your first knee-jerk reaction is just seeing all those guys in the dugout, yeah. just to hang around and went out there. They, I mean, they could have gone home and enjoyed time with their families. They could have been doing their work in here or, or off enjoying the rest of their day, but uh, they hung out there and dug out, and, and that meant a lot to me, and, and that's something I'll never forget. And that just kind of shows you the uh, the fabric of this team and this, this organization, so that's something that, uh, that I'll remember for a long time, no matter what the results were. When did you notice the guys still hanging out, or did you kind of know they were going to do that? Uh, I mean, I, I, I knew a few of them were going to, uh, some, some of the guys were going to hang out, they told me they wanted to see, but then once... I thought I was going to throw like the fourth or fifth, and then once I got pushed to like the sixth because Chassin was dealing, um, I, I didn't know if they were going to still hang around because sometimes it's one of those things where it's like, you know, you stay for three or four and, and then sure. head out. But no, it was, I mean, so much respect for those guys. And, um, you know, it was, it, was, it was just one of those really cool mo moments. And then even the fans being all pumped up when I came out and before I even threw one up pitch, and, you know, I can't help but smile and think about it. So. Yeah, the, f the fans really had a nice reaction, Jimmy. Yeah, you don't often cool. see fans in spring training. Yeah, yeah, no, for sure, especially with today. It's kind of rainy and cloudy and gloomy, so that was, um, I mean, that's, I really appreciate that for everybody sticking around, not just, not just the guys in here, but, but all the fans, too. You're pretty amped up, a little nervous? No, no, I mean, I was excited. I wasn't really too amped up or nervous because, I mean, if I was, I'd probably be overthrown, but I felt like I was... You know, pretty easy. The effort wasn't, you know, I wasn't overthrown or nothing. I, I kind of got a little too quick when that when that guy got on first, the first couple of pitches. But other than that, I kind of reeled it back in a little bit. And it was really just the the, the 102 scene that just stayed flat in her half. I mean, anybody's gonna hit that. And then the uh, the, the second slider I threw to uh, what's this, the, the guy that the right center. It just kind of just caught too much plate. I mean, it didn't really back up, but it just got too much plate. So, I mean, that's really not a big deal. I mean, you, you think about, you know, the, the ground ball hits were, were pretty good pitches. So, it's, yeah. it's just it's something, that's, something that's happened to me a lot in my, my career is the, <laughs> the ground ball hits. So, they'll take those over the ones like the first hitter got. Yeah. We hear it all the time, you know, results don't matter. The stats yeah. don't matter in spring training. Was it almost better to go through an inning like that where you had to, you know, you're up and you're, you're amped up, you know, you're trying to pitch? You're, yeah, I mean, it's you kind of got like a little taste of everything. Yeah. I mean, um, you know, the guys on the throw the stretch, try to hold the guy on first because we had no outs right there, just trying to have the pitch out of that. And, you know, I was one pitch away from being out of that, and then I threw that slider that caught too much play. So that, that part was that part was probably the most frustrating to me, even more frustrating than the homer, you know, because I, I put myself in a position where, you know, made a good pitch, but the guy got a ground ball single, and then, you know, I got to where I think I had, I can't remember if I had one or two outs when that guy hit that ball in the gap, but, you know, I put myself in a position to get out of anything with just one run, and I didn't execute that pitch. So that's what frustrated me on the result side. But other than that, I mean, I'm very pleased with how everything went in. You know, even the work, the extra work I, had to do, I did in the bullpen was really well. Yeah, I think the, were all three strikeouts breaking balls? Yeah. Does that sound like right um, two on curveballs, one on a slider? Okay, the lefty right. was a slider. Yeah. No, it was two lefties, right? Two yeah. lefties. And, yeah, one of the lefties was curveball, one was a slider, mm -hmm. and then the righty, the last righty was curveball. So I mean, your breaking stuff was good. Yeah, and that's what I said from from Jump Street. You know, like I, I had to clean up like, some things mechanically oh, with with oh, the uh, arm path for health reasons and. It's made it more efficient, and um, it's, it's helped the spin. It's made, made my off stuff sharper. I even got you know, some, the swing miss on the changeup today, so it was a good, good changeup, good action on that uh, big left. That's skull. Huh? Yeah, skull. skull. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 curveball, spike changeup, and I threw another changeup. So that was good. The pitchability is there, and everything is just literally a couple, a couple. A couple of pitches that were just a few inches from where I was trying to throw it. Where do you put this as a benchmark, Nick? I mean, a big, a big, you know, now this is behind you. To me, of... this is a step. The, all the bullpens and the live VPs and, and the inner squad, that's just a formality, you know. Like, I think that this is the actual step, you know, getting to the game and, and getting that one on your belt. And, you know, the, the command's there, you know. Like, I didn't really, I don't think I got to 3 2 on her. Well, I don't think I got 3 balls. I don't think you were full. You know, for me, I'm just trying to. In spring training, for anybody, you're trying to get over the plate and then work off that and polish up. You know what I'm saying? And you don't want to work your way from out in. You want to work your way from in out. So um, that's just a part of the process. And obviously, some of those pitches I missed today will tighten up. But 
Yeah, this is this is definitely to me an actual step compared to some of the bull pens and live BPs and stuff. Mm. Probably got a guy in the best match with a different uniform. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Will you do a couple innings later this week then, or maybe? Yeah, the hopefully. Well, I'm on a five day now, so yep. on Saturday the, the game is for three innings. So hopefully get three then. Since okay. I basically threw one in the game and then another controlled inning in the bullpen. Are the splits so. that day? No, uh, I have no clue. I think so. I think that's that that yeah. Do you know so which one you have? Is it split seven? No. I got a lot of I should sure. throw one yeah. inning of one and two in the other one. No. no. Unless it's a double road <laughs> split squad. No. We've had, our, we've had our only one of those. Yeah. So, no, so, yeah. So, hopefully, uh, get three innings there and just, just go from there. But, um, yeah, I mean, everything's there. It's just, just, uh, just a matter of building up, like I've always said. And I, I still think that there's more in the tank. You know, like I didn't feel like I was necessarily throwing 100% effort out there. You know, it was pretty... Pretty crazy. Like right 93 in the gun, is that about what you thought? 90, he, he touched 95. Yeah, yeah. 95 yeah. up there. Yeah, yeah. so yeah. I mean, that's usually, I mean, usually my health game is sitting, you know, mid 90s. So, yeah. you know, you got to think in a game after I get stretched out and get some more yeah. some more innings under my belt over the next however long. And we'll yeah. probably be right back to where he's yeah. yeah. The good thing is the refinement and the, the shape of my off speed stuff is actually better than it ever has been before. So we know the fastball is going to be there, you know, because I'm really only a couple miles an hour from it anyway, which that's nothing. But I mean, if you're seven, eight miles an hour off, that's, that's a little right. bit more worrisome. But right. when you're literally a couple miles an hour, that's a matter of, you know, getting a good night's rest or not, you know? Well, you yeah. might be there yeah. no short surgery that first time out. I mean, yeah. you guys kind of work up yeah. to your yeah. velocity. There's another thing, down. too, that's interesting, and, and we're able to see it with all of our tech is, is the, the effective velocity, the perceived velocity can be different than what the gun says. And that's really that's all that matters because that's what the hitters, that's what it's looking like to the hitter. So if you can increase your effective velocity with extension, with your release being closer to the plate, or with getting better spin on, on all your pitches, which I know I am getting better spin on the off speed stuff because they've showed me the numbers. Um, then that will make your pitches look sharper or look harder than they actually are, like Freddie. Well, I was going to say you Freddie know? pitching up yeah. high at 91, 92. Yeah. It looks but like, it looks like 96, 95. Yeah. Like, yeah, because he's extending to the plate. He's getting the spin on it. You yeah. know? So there's that. all of that we're finding out over the last few years while it's tech contributes to what it actually looks like. You know, So the number on the scoreboard, you know, it's for the fans. But um, really just got to read the swings and stuff. And so, yeah, I'm, I'm happy with it. I'm, Gonna go get some work in for the next one. Yeah. Feeling good right now? Yeah, yeah, I feel good. I mean, shoulder feels fine, I'll feel tired. Right now. Good. Thanks, Jimmy. Good stuff. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it.